Girl Sugars. My name is Nomza Mushangase and this is my YouTube channel where I speak about all things books, DIY and lifestyle. If that is your kind of jam, please do hit that subscribe button. Hit that little bell to get notified every single time your homegirl posts a video. I started this vlog last night. I had tea. I started planting Gardens in Graves Volume 3 by R.H. Sin. I'm currently on page 49. The first 15 pages were really just like Goville and had I read them last year, I would have felt them more. And I'm like, mm-hmm. I know I know that feeling listen to this one no going back your apologies won't change my mind just like my tears never made a difference and I know that's right I know that's right <laughs> any kind of heartbreak that you're going through I think any poem would resonate with you I'm enjoying this so far today I started in at the deep end by Kate Davies <laughs> <laughs> Julia, uh, she's just in a dry spell, is having a lot of thoughts and anxieties, just feelings towards her sexual life. It's like Julia says all the things that we are afraid to say. That's basically the read so far. Make myself a cup of tea. I'm gonna read some more in my chair. I'll talk to you guys later. I get these threatening messages. Uh, too much for me, for us, for everything, and I know you're tired, and I know you want to be together, which of course I do want it as well. I understand it, but everything will be alright. I was in so. The check that will probably bounce. The thing I do when I come back from Amsterdam is cash this check. I count every single day. <laughs> I was waiting for me to be like, you've unblocked this contact because... <laughs> Where I was living, but my mom is living. He's spoken to her on the phone. He knows where I am. Sending a lot of messages. Now, so let's just stop and stop it. No, girl, don't do it. Thank you for everything I think that you have done. And I make a shit. Bye 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 I can tell you. Guys. I can Hey. Don't give up the names. They are protected. Through drowning and famine. Natural disasters. My baby has been around for me. Kingdoms have fallen. Angels be calling. None of that could. Today is literally meal prep, clean my room, do some little self care. It's really hard to film self care, doing like meal preps. Like you have to get like different angles of you doing sometimes the same thing or different things. I really applaud people who who do that. Like ciao. It was definitely not for me. I didn't read a lot as I wanted to last night. This book it follows Julia and you know she finally meets someone that person basically makes her feel like shit so someone was like guys have you ever looked at a couple and wonder how their sex would be and then you actually do like a judgment thing they look like they have great sex or nah these two have work as sex sometimes when i look at a couple i'm like i wonder how your sex life is she has never really labeled herself i mean i think she liked guys for a while right now she kissed the girl and she actually liked it i like julia she's kind of funny i'm liking this book i'm going to read a little bit now i'm gonna do some self-care so 
yeah, I'll talk to you guys later. I don't know if it's cis men or what when it comes to communicating about sex especially it's just that just do it and they don't want to have a healthy co conversation about it and be like what is it that i'm doing wrong what is it that i'm doing right what is it that you like what is it that you don't like like finn did not even prepare her to have sex he did not even do foreplay like mate it's just cis men are the problem that's it that's all i have a few i have a few thoughts i'm on page 77 so i was quite enjoying this book i liked our main character now she is a lesbian what i liked about her finny i guess was that not like some grand thing that happened to her she just had sex with a woman and she enjoyed it and she was like oh i'm a lesbian everything about this book is not like with queer people everything needs to be grand gesture like something big needs to happen for her it's just like i had sex with a woman and i enjoyed it therefore i am a lesbian in a normal how she came out to her parents like oh by the way i'm i'm a lesbian and that's that it's such a weird thing for me because straight people never get to come out so i don't understand why queer non-binary gay lesbian people need to come out I just don't see, I just don't get it. It's a thing that sometimes I sit in the toilets and think about because I'm just like, why? Like, there's no need, you can just be you, bro. Anyways, that was a little rant. There's some weird moments that I'm having with this book. Like, is she taking this decision seriously or she's taking it lightly just because she wants to belong somewhere? Those are my thoughts for now and I'll talk to you guys later. <laughs>